Good morning here. It is October 2nd here in Western Newfoundland. And uh, me and my buddy Fred, um, if you watched our grouse catch and cook last year, then you'll know who I'm talking about. My little redhead buddy. Um, we're going to be heading in to uh, Pinsbrook to do some grouse hunting. And I don't feel bad telling you the name of this area. It's so popular here. Um, I mean, I literally just watched nine cars go ahead of us. Uh, probably moose hunters. Um, sorry, not even ahead of us. I'm here just waiting for Fred now. He's on the way and uh, going to meet him and we're going to hop in and uh, go do some grouse hunting, hopefully. So uh, hopefully once, uh, you know, sunrise comes, uh, I think it might be legal shooting late now, actually, but it doesn't matter. Um, the grouse tend to get up with the sun, so you can get away with even waking up at legal shooting late and go into your spot. So uh, yeah, hopefully a little bit later in the morning when uh, some of the moose hunters get off the road, uh, the birds will come out more and hopefully we'll see a few before then. So hopefully it'll be a good morning grouse hunting. So guys, we're coming down the road here. Can't really see it that great. Oh, yes you can. You're telling me that's not a beat down game path. Look at that. That's like, everything gotta be using that, man. That's crazy. Right down to a pond, so it makes sense. First bird of the morning, guys. Nice big spruce bows in the middle of the pond. Let me go up and see what we can do. Good old vintage 16 gauge. Big man. You good? There's another one right here, I think. Yep, yeah, another one right here. That one right here, guys. Got her going. Got the video? Yes, sir. She's loud. Boom. Oh, oh, there you go, sir. All right, boys. In walking now to get one of the grouse that Braden just shot. Walking through the trees here now. He's gone to get his, so I said I'd walk here to get his for him. The other one. And look at this. What a beauty, man. What a nice male. Beauty male. So that's two first thing in the morning. Nothing wrong with that. Here we go. Two nice males, it looks like, eh? Yes, man, they're big. They're two nice. big males. Two nice males, yeah. I haven't killed or seen a female this year. I don't believe... 16 gauge, getting her done. She's a bright one out, guys. Half time now, if there even is a bird, you're not even gonna see it. So all we're doing here is we're, uh, we're driving these dirt trails and roads. Um, if it's on the road, you hop off to the shoulder and you shoot it. During the trails, um, well, it doesn't matter. Um, you can say road hunting and whatever in the comments you want, but if you're from Newfoundland or any area that you know has any amount of grouse, that's generally how you hunt them. That's what you do. Um, we do walk some trails and everything, but why would you walk the trails when they're in the roads, right? So, this is what I'm saying. Look at this. You can't even see any birds if they're there. Well, yeah, it's a great morning, starting to warm up, so the birds should start to uh, hop out on the roads here now. They generally get up with the sun, so that's awesome. Let's see what we can do with the rest of the morning. It's all good grouse territory here, guys. Spruce grouse and rough grouse. Primarily a lot of spruce grouse where we're at, but, um, you know, you get the odd... Uh, you get the odd roughy. Um, they are around, so... Yeah, this is all you do. You drive these old trails and we'll walk the odd one and walk down in the woods sometimes and, you know, along the roads and just spook them up. It's all a good habitat.
Pick up your garbage, people. Pick it up. Going for a little walk here now. Fred's using the 410 today. Single shot. Like I said, I got my 16 gauge single shot. Um, this trailer looks pretty good for some spruce grouse. Not really rough grouse territory, but I mean, you can see them anywhere. I've seen some grouse in some pretty weird spots. Not even a good beer, man. Like, guys, if you're looking to uh, go hunt spruce groves, whether you're from Newfoundland or not, um, this kind of area, this is what they love. Mossy bottom, spruce trees everywhere. You walk enough area like this, or you drive some roads that got area like this, your, uh, your luck will pay off. I can promise you, you'll find some. Well, guys, I walked in the woods uh, just see if I can spook out a grouse. Look, we're getting attacked. Just squirrel up there, tossing acorns down or something. <laughs> you are allowed to shoot squirrel here in Newfoundland. Well, guys, we stumbled upon an old bear bait. Tree stands just over there. Cool. Well, we're stopped here now on the trail. We're gonna head her back out. Two birds. Um, <laughs> he talked to a couple other bird hunters and they're not seeing much. They saw some early this morning. So uh, I'd say we'll be back in the week when, uh, when everybody's busy. So could see something on the way out still. It's one o'clock about, I think. You know, all right day. Guys, we're on the way out, and there's a roughie just here. Just darted in the trail. Nice rough grouse. You see him? He kind of darted off. Just watch here in the ditch. Up here, up here. Come here, come here. Up there. See him scurrying away? Up right here, up right here. Come here, see him? Look straight up, straight up, see him there? Fred, perfect shot. See him there? Oh yeah. Okay. Fire, shooting, shooting. It's the only shot you're gonna get. Okay, running after him. They scurries, man. We're gonna find them. We keep walking forward. Come on, run, Fred. Run. Right here in front of me, come on. Yeah, he flew right through this, Fred. Find a lake up through here somewhere. So I found him just then, he was on the ground. That don't mean he didn't land in the tree this time. Stupid of me, I should have brought my gun in too. Check the trees, buddy. Was well, Fred seen in again? Like we're kind of ambushing him, and every time uh, one of us gets close, he flies. So thick. I'm gonna go get the 16 gauge and meet up with him. We just heard a shot, guys. I don't know if you got him or not. This is a big rock. We were literally just turning around in the trail, and uh, you got him. Where do you go? Well, I was looking for that roughie. 
Got a sprucey. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yes. Nice, nice. Keep looking for that roughy, Fred. Yeah. Well, guys, that wasn't our intended target. I mean, right now. I'll take a spruce, guys. I love them. But, uh, yeah. You know what happens? We just, I say we just walked in, like, five kilometers probably Eight we literally minutes. just walked five kilometers from from the road and we just kept driving them and driving them and he kept going and going and you get a couple shots but you can see how thick this woods is like, like it's very hard like i'll just put my barrel up here like you got like a split second to even get a shot before you hit something so i had two shots fired off but uh i didn't manage to hit them you know the old 410 is good but through brush it's not even a 16 gauge, even a 12 gauge would have a bit of trouble through this brush we're in right now it's not so much pellets hitting the brush, it's trying to get a clear shot at them. Yeah, but uh, yeah, that spruce, he was just sitting here. But I don't know. I might walk in a little bit more and head down to the road. See if we can flush something else. Whew. Fred's gone up there to go find the car. We genuinely just walked like five kilometers. I was just looking at my map, I think it was 4.2. 4. 4. After a stud roughy, he got away. And that's why he's mature. But I mean, I've always said in my gross videos, if you pick a spot that looks good and you just walk in the woods, you're going to find birds. And I mean, it shows. You're going to find them. That is a huge, huge spruce gross. That's really, that's really nice. But uh, whew. we went in the road. Fred said, oh, we're going to turn around because we're going to head back there like do some duck hunting. Um, and uh, turned around about two minutes on the way out. Ruffy. And, uh, yeah, he couldn't get a clear shot from the, the road. But uh, we chased him in, and he's seen him twice. <laughs> Madness, but that's what it's all about. That's the fun in it. And, I mean, like I said, you work, you're going to get rewarded. Either way, you work, you're going to get rewarded. So, uh, yeah, we'll see if we get anything on the way out. Uh, if not, well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Small game hunting in western Newfoundland.